My name is David Sun. I'm currently a third year student at University of Waterloo. And the name of my program is Accounting and Financial Management. Some of the roadblocks I had when struggling balancing school and social life is definitely time management. I'm currently in school right now, so a day in my life will usually involve just like waking up for classes, usually around, I'll say like 10, yeah, I'll take some time off, maybe go to the gym, um, grab some lunch, go to the library, study until like seven or eight, and grab some dinner. Living independently, it come with a lot of self-regulation. I really had to figure out a way basically to balance my school and my social life over the past few years. Sometimes it is difficult to focus on academics when there are constant distractions such as going out with friends and this kind of really resulted in me constantly working under tight deadlines. One concept I have used to kind of battle these roadblocks is the concept of time management matrix. So essentially a classifies task into four different quadrants. The first quadrant being the most urgent and important, the second quadrant being not urgent but important, and third quadrant being urgent but not important, and finally the last quadrant being neither urgent nor important. By utilizing the system, I've seen like a significant increase in both my efficiency and quality of the work I perform. I have never missed a single deadline since. When I received the offer for Waterloo, I was extremely happy because it's a symbol that like I finally in a career that I, that I want to pursue. One area I'm motivated to pursue after graduation is financial advisory, specifically in the field of m and I have actually always been interested in m and because personally I feel the work is extremely rewarding. The work is very intellectually motivating and kind of creates a high visibility within the organization. One big one that I feel very proud of is the fact that I want to start in Deloitte as a financial analyst for the m and of the advisory team. The feeling that I had when I got into Deloitte was no doubt very rewarding. I don't want to set myself to one particular career uh, without like exploring other options. The hardest part is no doubt like basically coming up with a method for people to respond to you. There are like hundreds of other applicants doing the exact same thing as you. So I guess it's important for you to like find method for yourself to stand out during this whole application process. And I think I just had to like find ways for people to answer your cold emails and set up those coffee chats so they recognize your name. Francesca helped me a lot with the whole application process. Really without Francesca, I honestly don't think I will be as confident as I am when I applied. Also just in general, just like helping me figure out what I wanted to do. We had many talks about basically about my future and then what I potentially want to do. And then more importantly, like a job that like specifically sued me where I can like kind of really utilize like my personality and skills. And I think those are very important conversations that we had very grateful for, for what Francesca did for me there, so yeah.